Hi everyone, here I am again, Rainy with Why Am I Green? And today, I have something really interesting to show you. I mentioned this in the last video that I'll put link to the end of this one so you can see the connection. So let's get to it. Okay, what I'm going to show you today is ways of starting seeds quicker. Now, there's a couple different methods. The first one I found online the other day called scarification. Now, think of that, scarification. What's the active word there? Scar. So what you do is you actually take, I'm doing these with bean seeds again. You actually take the seeds and you scar them or you scrape off some. I don't know if you can see the seed here. You actually scrape off some of the shell, okay, or sand off some of the shell. And when you plant it, they say it's supposed to grow faster. So let's see if we can do that. We're going to sand off a little bit of the shells and see if we can get them to go faster. And let's see, I have a great process to do that right here. Okay, are you ready? I'm just kidding. I'm not really going to use the sander on it, okay? Uh, that would be nice. But seeds are going to go flying everywhere. So here's how we're going to do it. We're actually going to take some sandpaper I have here. Let me see. There we go. And I'm going to sand just a part of it off. Actually, this might be a little bit too rough of sandpaper. Oh, that came off pretty fast. I'm going to go a little bit on the back side. So there's one. And we'll speed this process up for you, okay? Here we go with the string bean speed up process. And one left. Ta-da! Okay. So we sanded them all. Now, let's see. I'm going to put them in these two here. And as you can see, they say, sanded. Sanded. Kind of reminds you of Mr. Bean, huh? His movie skills. That's where I learned how to do my movie skills. So I'm going to do just like I did before. We're going to put one, two, three in each one. Now, I'm using the same starter mix. This is the Jiffy starter mix. I'm using the same one in both, so that way we know that the soil had nothing to do with it. It's just a scarification that made it go faster. Okay, so we get them all buried. And there's another process I want to show you, and we're going to do that in comparison. And this other process is called soaking them. I was watching a video on the scarification one day, and at the bottom of the video, somebody says, oh, when I was a kid, my granddaddy used to soak the beans uh, overnight. So I soaked these beans in water, and you can see they're a little wrinkled up now. I soaked them in water for about 15 hours. Okay, so what we're going to do is these two say soaked. So they were soaked for 15 hours, and they're actually soft enough to eat. So we're going to go ahead and put those in. And I will put them in the mix with the others that we did in the previous video. Hey, everyone. This is day four for the seeds that were soaked for 15 hours before planting and the ones that were sanded. Here's the two that were sanded. If you recall, when we did the last check, only this one had come up, and it really hasn't grown that much. And for the one that was soaked, this one has started to show some improvement, but they pretty much stopped. And we'll go ahead and look at them in another few days. Bye-bye now. Hey everyone, this is Rainy, and today is going to be the final day for the comparison test with the soaked 
versus the sanded string bean seeds that we did. Uh, this is one day later. I showed you yesterday and today, one day later, not much of anything has happened. That one there is just sitting there, kind of sad looking. <laughs> and over here, these two, oh, by the way, these were the sanded, this was the sanded one. And the soaked one, as you can see, there's basically three of them, but let's see if I can kind of, yeah, so you can see they're just kind of going there, just kind of sitting there, but not doing anything. So I think what I'm going to do before uh, they just kind of rot away or whatever they're doing might be the soil they don't like as well. I'm going to see if I can put them in some of the garden soil and see if we can salvage them. Now, if you're watching any of my other videos, I did this test alongside of the test where I was doing all the different kinds of soil. And so all these seeds were planted at the same time. So just to give you a comparison, you can see some of the other seeds in the same tray did do well. Look at that one down there. And here's another whole tray that I planted also on the same day. So you can see why I want to uh, do something different with these seeds. They should have had some growth. So it was a good test. Yes, the sanded and soaked seeds did come up quickly. They sprouted quickly, but then they just kind of stayed there. So you can try it if you like. Uh, I think there's something to be said for the good old natural way of planting a seed and letting nature take its course. So thanks for watching, and remember, if you're not growing, you're not green. By the way, don't forget to subscribe and share this video with your friends. I appreciate you watching. Bye-bye.